Hello, everybody. Last match of the day and last match of the last 64 round. So we will have the two last players who will qualify for the next round. And this time, this amazing match will be commentating Alberto Garcia Ramos with me. Hello, Alberto. How are you? Hello, Alberto. So, yeah, let's present the players. We have Pijus Labutis from Lithuania, Chris Alexander from the United Kingdom, David Alcaide from Spain, and Eilul Kibaroglu from Turkey. So, hello, guys. Are you ready hello. for this match? Yes. So, the order will be Pijus will play with Chris at the same time. And then David with Elul. So if you are ready, guys, uh, good luck and you can break. Good luck. So let's see the last match. Yeah, we had a really interesting match since today. Yeah, it was an exciting day like the previous days. And I'm sure this one will be really really tough to get qualified. Yeah, so so far today we had uh, really interesting matches with Joshua and Fedor and Margaret. And yeah, we hope to see a nice performance today, right Alberto? From these four players yeah all of them made pretty good results and oh, look at that he just try break uh, on the first first try break of the match and the second one is from chris unfortunate start so, so it's chris... turn for david and elul no no the, uh, chris oh, made he... one ball on the break oh he made one ball okay yeah 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 so he took ball in hand. He's playing for 10 points. So, open table for him. Yeah, it looks good. Yeah. Oh, oh my god. What a miss. So two points for Chris. Yeah, it's the two ball in the middle pocket. And now turn for David and Elul. First break. Yeah. So not so good start for Pijus and Chris. Good break from David. Wow, nice break. Yeah. Made two balls. A nice control break from Elul. Yeah, she made one ball on the side. Yeah. And I'm sure she will be fighting on this match because she showed a really good performance on the women's event. Yeah. So, ball in hand for both players. So they are playing for 10 points. Let's see this shot from David. Oof, tough shot now for Eilul. Yeah, she's oh. almost frozen. Oh, and David missed. Oof. So, three points for... Three points for David. So yeah, so far, DB3, Chris 2, and PG 0 points. Yeah, so really good and chance for Elul to take yeah. the lead. Yeah, exactly.
So table looks pretty open. Yeah, maybe the, this five is a bit tough. I think it's a little bit too thin. She needs to get past the seven. Oh. Oof. She got a kiss, but she was yeah. lucky enough. <laughs> she sees it, but yeah, it was tough. Oh, good stroke on that six. Wow. And I think she can cut the short, seven. But yeah, she sees it perfectly, I think. Yeah, we have people in the comments supporting David, saying hello from Nerva Villar, from Chile. Hello, Miranda. How are you? Hope you are enjoying this match. And Elul made perfect shape for the eight. I think she... Oh, nice chance for the 10 points. And she made it 10 points, it. Elul. Yeah. Taking the lead. So now second break for Pichus and Chris. Elul is leading with 10 points. David second place with three. Chris two points and Pichus last with zero points. Good break from Chris. And I don't know if he can play without Bonnie Han. Mm, I think he will take it because the one there looks pretty tough. Oof. Mm. Almost made the three. But Pichus can go for the one pull run out, right? Yeah, I'm sure about it. He has a good shot on the one, two, and three are close to the pocket, so it's a good chance for him. And looks like Chris is going to play without Bonihan. No, no. He took it. So, P is playing for a one pull run out. It yeah. means 15 points and Chris playing for 10. Yeah, and we want to remember the audience that uh, both of them classified in the qualifiers. And we saw a great performance. As we can see, P just is really fast. Three more balls to yeah, score 15 to points. And Chris has a pretty good layout, right? Yeah, that's right. It's a nice chance for P just to make 15 points and he will take the lead. Good shot from Chris, and let's see now. Oh, good shot. Yeah. Has a nice angle to come back yeah. for 10. And, and 15 just points. It. Yeah. So 15 points for Pijus. 
and the shot for 10 points from Chris. He made it. So now turn for David and Elul. Second Elul, break. Yeah. <laughs> Looks like a good break from the beat. Yeah, Let's nice see this break. nine. Wow. Mm. Like, yeah. And is it try so from the two? Yeah, it's right, Greg. Unfortunate. Well, she got uh, 10 points in the previous inning, so she should be good for this one with 10 points. David playing for 10 points. Yeah, he needed to take one hand. And pretty good layout. He had a nice break there. Just the one was difficult. Because of the nine. Shot by the lead. Oh, well executed that one. You hold the cue ball perfect. So yeah. he needs good angle now on the nine. Perfect. Yeah. And last Perfect. shot for ten points. So oh, 10 points for the lead, 0 points for Elul in the second break, and now turn for Pijus and Chris, break number three, and actually Pijus is still with 15 points, then second place for the lead with 13, third place for Chris with 12, and last position for Elul with 10 points. Yep. People cheering Elul from the chat. Hello, you, Yehuda. I don't know if I say it right. How do you think, Alberto? Yeah, I think it's <laughs> quite okay. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Okay. Chris with ball in hand, right? He made one ball on the break. And, yeah. With ball in hand. Look at this and break from Pijus. Good break from Pijus, but yeah, he also needs to take ball in hand. Well, if he wants to risk, probably he could play the Karum 1 9. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But yeah, he's leading the score, so it's not really necessary. Takes ball in hand to play the carom. We've seen this uh, a couple of times in one pool. It's a good strategy to to remove one of one difficult ball if the carom is easy. The combination, sorry. Yeah, yeah. It all depends of 
the rest of the table in the yeah. layout. But in this case, I think it was smart choice. Because before he needed to move the seven ball from one side of the table to the other. But now he doesn't. Yeah. And it's a tough shot now for Chris. He has the cue ball frozen to the cushion. Yeah. Ah, uh, he missed. It was so long. Oh, six points for Chris. Oh, let's see the shot from Pichus. I'm not sure if he's straight. If he's not, probably he could play a follow shot. Yeah, he had small angle, so it was okay. Yeah. Good confidence stroke on that seven. And 10 points for Pijus. So now yeah. turn for David and Ilul. Yeah, nice run out from Pijus now. Puts himself with 25 points, right? Yeah, leading actually with 25 points. Oh, is it dry from the bid? Yeah. Dry break for him. And really, really nice break from Elul. But he needs to take ball in hand. Yeah. That's for sure. So, ball in hand, she's playing for 10 points. Good chance to climb to the second position. Yeah, she would need more than eight points to catch Chris. <laughs> to climb to the second. <laughs> Oh, a lot of people supporting Elul in the comments. And shout out to Clubitis from Marios Pulas. Hello. Guys, please comment, like the video and share. Want to know your thoughts on this format and on this tournament. Yeah, and also if you have any question, we can reply them or we can try. Good shot. Yeah, and go down on the, on the yeah. seven. It's pretty good to to finish this track. Oh, nice stroke. Yeah, he's good on the eight. She, sorry. <laughs> Looks pretty good to play a stop shot now. Yeah. 
Yeah, in perfect shape for the last ten ball. Really nice. Well yeah, done. Ten points for her. And ten and now, points for Elul. Yeah. Now turn for Peaches and Chris. Break number four. Peaches keeps leading the score with 25 points, points but now Elul is in second position with 20. Then third, Chris with 18. And last position for David with 13. Well, we see a nice break from Chris now. Put the four on the side pocket. Yeah, let's see if he has a shot on the one. Looks like, yeah. But probably the position is not that easy. Oh, we great from Oof. Peaches. And this is there. Yeah. He all went he, crazy. He wished he hadn't pocket that one to play the 15, but yeah. Yeah, good shot from Chris. Yeah, he went to fit for 15, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So one put run out for Chris. And let's see. He just takes ball in hand for this rack. So one hand for Peaches. And we have Francisco Sanchez on the comments saying us hello, Alberto. We miss you hello, here. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you communicating with us. <laughs> yeah, so Francisco already passed the first round. Yeah, he's waiting to play on Saturday, I think. Yeah. We have also Javi del Santo saying, vamos, <laughs> supporting David. His nickname is Culata. And Chris just positioned really, really good for the five. Yeah. He made it perfect. That eight throws into the cushion, it might be difficult. Yeah, and he was probably a bit short on that shot. Yeah. So let's see. He's checking the combo. Nine tennis available. No, a good shot from Chris. Oh, yeah, moving the 10 ball. Yeah, so 15 wow. points for Chris and 10 well, for pitches. Yeah, well done. Yeah, good run outs. And now turn for David and Ilul. Nice really good break. break. Yeah. Both wingles, balls are straight uh, to the side pockets. And it was dry break for yeah. Elul. Dry for Elul. Opportunity for a one ball run out for David. Tough shot because the cue was 
really close to the cushion. Yeah, but probably he could play it soft, like the one and I think the cue ball should be okay. But probably he has more angle than we can see here on the camera. Yeah. Oh, he decided to use three rails and it's perfect. Mm, really, really nice position. Great shot. Yeah, it was an easy to avoid. Sometimes I wish we had the, the instant replay in this format. Yeah, but it's a bit difficult with two cameras, cameras at the same time. Yeah, that's why we, we don't use it, but yeah, should be good. Maybe next time. <laughs> yeah, if, if you want to watch the replay, just scroll back a little bit and it's enough. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Bit risk, yeah, there, but it's okay. Animo David, Jose Antonio Rodriguez, and Marius saying, Let's go, Pijus, shoot out from Lithuania. Wow, nice. Yeah, nice shot. Just four ball left, four balls left. Let's see what he can do. Soft with one cushion or harder with two. Yeah, two cushions. Yeah. Now he has a nice shot on in the eight. Simonas from Lithuania, also Jane Pichus from YouTube. People in YouTube are commenting less. <laughs> yeah, normally it's more typical on Facebook. Yeah. Come on, guys, don't be shy. Let us know your thoughts on the format. Do you like the layout? Do you like the tournament players? Yeah, so one more word. For the bid to make 15 points. Perfect. Yeah. Nice we'll one put run out from David. He got himself 15 points. Yes, yeah, so now turn for Peaches and Chris. Break number five. And Peaches is leading with 35 points. Second, Chris with 33. Third, David with 28. And last position for Elul with 20 points. So a good break from Chris, but I don't know if he can play the one. We don't know for sure if he sees it. And I think the two ball is behind the nine, right? Mm, yeah, I think so. And also looks like he has six and seven close to each other. So I don't know. Could you just just take taking more hand. hand. Yeah. Increase going for 15 points, right? Yeah. You didn't take it. Nice. Yeah, he saw it perfectly. 
Yeah, but now he has to solve the problem. The problem. Yes. More people supporting pictures in the comments. Virginitus, Mantas, and Venas. Oh, good effort from Chris. He wanted to solve that problem, but he didn't touch it. Good shot on the side. Yeah. He needs something to separate the six. Yeah, probably this shot now. He has to yeah. make the four. Looking for two or four rates. What do you think? Yeah, two or four. If he does, doesn't touch it with two, then he can do it with two more on the corner. Mm, he didn't touch oh. it. Wow, I didn't see that. Yeah, B just made a really good shot in the seven. And Chris got a nice position for the five. Is it the five? Yeah, it's a five. Yeah, 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 yeah. I didn't see that position. Oh, sorry. Oh, it was a seven. Really, wow. really nice. Yeah. Perfect position he made. Wow. And Pius made the 10 ball, so he scored 10, 10 points. points. Yep. Oh, good cut nice shot on the line. Yeah. Both for 15 points. Yeah. Important one. I like made it. So another one pull run out from Chris, two in a row. And now turn for David and Ilul. Good break from the beat. Also from the lul. Yeah, and this one is really, really important for David because he can go for 15 points again. Yeah, and the layout looks not bad. Yeah. One, three, and four shouldn't be a problem. A lul with ball in hand. She has a little cluster there with the eight and the nine. Just looking at it right now, probably trying to solve it with the ball in hand. Yeah, it should be okay to solve it with the two ball. It's so close to them, so. Or maybe she has a nine combo. Or I think, yeah, or the eight to the, to the side pocket. Oh, yeah, that's right. If she makes a six, the eight should be yeah. free to make it on the side. Yeah.
Of the draw shot from Redul. Yeah. Really nice draw. And now she just needs to stop shot the ball there. Oh, she just has to take the cushion. <clears throat> yeah. And David, two more balls to score yeah. another 15 points. Perfect shape on the 10 from the bib. Really nice. Um, yeah, where it's run out. 15 points. Yeah, and we see that shot on the 8. Perfect. Nice chance to get the 10 points. We're watching a really, really good performance from the four players. They yeah. missed some some breaks, but whenever they put pocket the balls, they just get tens and fifteens. Yeah, that's right, and that's another ten for Perfect. Elud. Yeah. So now turn for PG and Chris. Half of the match is over after these breaks, and now. Chris is leading with 48 points. Then second place for Pijus with 45. Third place for David with 43. They are really close to each other. And then a bit behind, Elul with 30 points. Oh. Well, oh. he got the three ball. Yeah. You know, sometimes the balls, three and two hits there. And one of them goes into the pocket. Powerful break from Pijus. He makes the six ball on the top corner, top right corner pocket. And he has a nice chance for a one ball run out. Yeah, Chris took one in hand. And he let's see. What? Oh, sorry. Yeah, let's see PGC. I think probably he's able to draw it to get position into the two. Yeah, it might be maybe easier than hitting the cushion. There's there are too many balls. Yeah. I think if he decides to draw, he has to find a way between the seven and the four. Or, yeah, I think he was taking to lift the kill ball next to the right top corner pocket. But no. Yeah, he's going for the. Yeah. Oh, he was straight enough to do it like that. And he's perfect, perfect. in the two. So he's playing for 15 points. Chris for 10. And he has a long shot now. Oof, tough shot. Oh, Chris missed the five. Oh, yeah. Four points for Chris. And Pijus half has a tough shot now on the three ball. Gotta be short there. Yeah. It's tough, and I think he can play it soft enough to then get position into the four. Ah, oh, he missed. Yeah. Oh, four points for him as well. Um, actually, I think it's three. Oh, yeah, three. 
yeah. Three points for Pichus. Um, yes, sir. So now turn for the Viv and Elul. Yeah, nice chance for them to catch it, to catch up in the scoreboard. Oh, it looks like a dry break from Elul. Yeah, she got wow. many pieces there. Yeah. And a perfect break again from David. Yeah, but I don't know if he can make the one. Mm, I don't think so. He he would have to go for the for the cushion. But I think he will go for the ten points to secure. Yeah. So bony hand for him. And if he makes this 10 points, he could climb to the first position. So Alberto, you played some of the qualifiers, right? Yep, but and sadly our... I didn't. I didn't even make it to the second round. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but how was the experience? It was really, really good. I played against uh, Moritz. Yeah, he's a first, really good player. Yeah, the first qualifier I lost against uh, Ivan Maluto. Mm -hmm. He was qualified. qualified. Yeah. Yeah. And. Hmm. I don't remember. But yeah, it was a nice experience. Yeah, so hopefully you will play in the next tournament, right? Yeah, for sure. Yeah, yeah we got lo lots of cool stuff coming up for next year. Uh, looks like David doesn't like this shot. Hmm. Right the spin should be okay to hold the cue ball there and have a good shot in the five. Yeah, like that. So, good things coming next year, Alberto. Something you can tell about, or is it a yeah, sweet sure. secret? We already announced it, but uh, the doubles tournament is coming up. We want to schedule it for January. Mm. And it should be interesting format. Many yeah, players want sure. to, to play it. Will, will you play it? Mm, I don't know. I think my my level is not that not this high. I should practice more. <laughs> <laughs> you have two months to practice. Yeah, it should, should be enough. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, it's really difficult to get level like these players. Yeah, and also training in, in diamond table is so tough. I don't know how David and, and Francisco and all these players do it. It's really, really tough. It's amazing. Yeah, the secret. So many years putting balls. Yeah. <laughs> and David playing for 10 points. Really good. Puts himself in first position now. Yes, yeah, first position for David now. 
second Chris just one point behind with 52. Then Pidgeot's 49 and they lose 30. So break number seven. And Luis is asking you, Alberto, how many times have you eaten today? <laughs> I've eaten two times so far, breakfast and lunch. Why do you ask, Luis? <laughs> this question is for me, but... <laughs> okay. <laughs> Luis, you should specify <laughs> which Alberto you're asking. To. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, good chance for both players to play without Bonnie Hunt. Yeah, nice, nice break from both of them. And Chris is going for the one pull run out. Wow. Nice shot. Good shot. Yeah. And look at Piju's uh, queue. Did you see it? The extension? Yeah, he took his the... extension to play that shot. Yeah, it's so typical nowadays to use an extension like that. Yeah, that comes with a queue, right? Yeah, or you can buy, it depends on the brand of your yeah, queue. Yeah, yeah. I, I, I didn't see one like that until now. Oh, you mean this one? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, uh, oh, yeah. Once I had similar queue with the same system, but it was break queue. Mm. Oh. Both the players are playing, playing really, really fast. Yeah, really good. Yeah. In number six on the score, so 50. Position for the 10 ball. And Pidus to score 15 points. Yeah, both of them. Let's see Chris, if he can get the 15. So Lauren Dash is saying us hello, Alberto. Hello, you never miss any match from this time. <laughs> hello, Lauren. Many people supporting Pijus in the chat, in YouTube. Yeah, he's a great player from Lithuania. Probably the the best one of on that country. Wow! Yeah. Oh, look at this position. Uh, yeah, oof, he was yeah. <laughs> not lucky enough, but he can make this nine. Uh, we got Oof. shot. We got that. Nice shot. And perfect position. Oof. I like these players. Yeah. Oof. That was really close, but 15 yeah. points. 
And now turn for David and Elul. Wow. This is a really, really good score. Look at that. Look at that ranking. Yeah, it's really close. Let's see if David can make a good run out now. And Elul also. <coughs> Okay, good break from both. Both will have to take ball in hand, I think. Yeah, I think so. Well, probably David could play without, but it's too risky at this time. I think it's better to score 10 points. Be sure that. Yeah, and keep up in the ranking. Yeah. So yeah, both playing for 10 points. Yeah, Lauren, I know that the first two matches are too early for you, but you can watch them on One Sports TV. Everything is recorded. So. Oh my uh, God, look, look who we have watching. Danny Sanchez? Yeah. Yeah. Danny He's Sanchez. Right. Yeah. Our champion from Carom. He always likes to support our Spanish players. Yeah, and also our other competitions with the UMB. Yeah. Nice shot from both players. Yeah, that it needs good angle on the seven to make it mm -hmm. easier. And Ilul has a pretty good layout to finish their table. And a bit perfectly straight on the eight. He could play the nine on the side and clear the rack. Yeah, and the last shot for Elul for 10 points. Yeah, so 10 points for nice. her. David also playing for 10 now. So, 10 points for the bid. Now, turn for Peaches and Chris. Three more breaks from each player to finish this match. And the score is pretty close between Chris, Peaches, and David. Mm, Chris leading with 67 points. Peaches second play with 64. David one point behind with 63. And Elul has 40 points. With this performance from the players. Oh, nice break from Chris, but yeah. yeah. Scratch, unlucky scratch from Pius. Yeah. And at this time on the match, you're unfortunate. So, zero points for Pijus. Let's see how Chris plays this layout. He's going for 15 points. Wow. Yeah, yes. Very good. He had the right space for the one and leave the three in position.
Oh, also Max is watching. Really exciting group, impressive, impressive performance from from all uh, four players. Hello, Max. Okay. Mm -hmm. it, it, yes. Uh, okay. Yeah, so sorry I made a small mistake. P just has 63 points. Yeah, it's correct in the scoreboard. So he's tied with David in the score. Oof, tough shot now. I think he got the wrong angle now for the seven. What do you think, Alberto? Mm, yeah, I think so, but probably he could leave the cue ball next to the side pocket. Play a cut shot on the seven. No, he decided to make it hard, three cushions. Mm, a bit closer. Yeah, but it's good. Yeah. Was a good stroke in that one. Mm. Maybe a bit short in this one. But I think he should be good to finish the rack. And let's remember he's playing for 15 points. Yeah. Oh, wow, he missed. Oh, oh unexpected miss. How and unfortunate. It was, yeah, it was really important. Eight points for him. And now turn for David and Eilul. Yeah, I'm playing for 15 points, that's really tough. Oh my god, oh. the nine. Almost. Yeah. So I'll drive break from a little. David also got kisses. But he made the two ball. He apologizes. Yeah. Let's see if he can make the one without yeah, This is a nice chance for David. To get on top of with the in the in the second position. I think this one is really tough. Not only make it because the position is really difficult. A lot of balls on the way. So probably a bowling hand could be nice. <clears throat> yeah, it's a really tough decision. Yeah. Scoreboard is too tight. I don't know. Be sure. I would take it. What about you, Alberto? I don't know. <laughs> if I could see the angle, but from here. Yeah. Well, it looked hard enough for David to take ball in hand. So I would probably have done the same. Yeah, because of course it's better to score 15 points and get the first place. But it wasn't easy. Yeah, and now he just needs, uh, no, with eight points, he should be good. 
because they they break later than P juice increase. Even with volume hand, it's difficult. Yeah, needs a good angle on the three to go for the fourth ball. And there are many balls in the center of the table. Oh, like he found the way. Wow. Yeah, he's perfect on the three. Nice, nice shot. Now, the key shot, I think, from four to five, Alberto. shot yeah pretty good position and he has a good position now to finish his rack Shot that five ball. Nice. Let's see if he's straight enough to draw it back to the center. Yeah, he's looking at the angle he needs to get to the nine, to the nine ball. Yeah, he was right. Perfect. Really nice position, perfect. Made it ten points for the bid. Perfect. Now, you could feel the pressure there. Yeah. Now turn for Pichus and Chris. Two more breaks for each player. Francisco Sanchez saying, "Wow, very exciting." Yeah. Yeah, it's really, really tight. Oh, is it right from Chris? No, he made one ball, right? Um, yeah, he made one ball. Yeah, he made one. And Pichus took ball in hand. Mm -hmm. He yep. made really good break, but he didn't have a shot on the one. So ball in hand for both players.
is looking at the combination. Mm. With the four, what do you think? Yeah, it should be okay. I, I'm checking because we have some comments on on Facebook and it was eight points for Chris on the last track. So Andres, if you can change it, please. I wrote eight, but they put nine, so yeah, he has 75 points. Yeah, thank you guys for your comments. Let's see now from four to five. Sometimes it's a bit tough to control the cue ball, especially the speed when you have a ball hanging in the pocket. And let's see this speed. And uh, Alberto, we we didn't say it, but uh, Chris just made the uh, ten points. Oh yeah, I, I wasn't watching. Yeah, sorry. We, yeah, we were checking. Sorry, guys, we were checking the video for last inning, but Chris just made the ten points with the combination with the two and the ten ball. Yeah, so it was 10 points for him. Yeah, sorry about that. Yeah, so Chris, early combos count. Last ball. Perfect. Yeah, so 10 points also for Pichus. Now turn for David and Nilul. Yeah, and Pichus and David still tied to 73 now. And <laughs> Yeah, Elul, you have to break. Probably she was asking if she needs to finish because I think she doesn't have chances now. So, one ball the break. Seven ball. And Elul has a good chance for 15 points. Yeah, she made a really good break now. And David again thinking if he needs to go for the 15 or the 10 points. He's looking at the angle on the two. And Jan is asking what happens if Al Qaeda and the Buddhists were tied in points. So you want to reply, Alberto? Yeah, of course. Uh, it's a really famous <laughs> thing we do here in uh, one pool. It's called the decider. So there will be a deciding rack 
between the two players that are tied. In this case, it will be David and Pius if they tie. So yes, yeah, Lauren just answered. There's uh, an extra rack for both of them. Yeah, so I think a little missed this one, so it was three points for her. Position for the four ball. With the straight on five. Okay. That's a good layout to finish this round. Yeah. This shot could seem simple, but under pressure, it's difficult one. Yeah, and let's remember, David is playing for 15 points. He's playing a one pull run out. Yeah, you're right. Wow. Oh, he missed. Oof. Oof. So. Oh, my God. Six That's... points for the lead. Yeah, six points. And let's check the score now. First position for Chris, leading with 85 points. Then second, David, with 79. Third place for P, just 73. And last for Elul with 43. So the first first player breaking this time, this last inning, will be Elul. So Elul, you can break this. Mm, I'm not sure if she can hear us. Elul? Elul, can you break? Send a winner to Maina. Okay, she's mm -hmm. going. Thanks. Then, second break will be for Pichus. She made two balls in this yeah, break. That's a good break, I think. Mm. Yeah, she can we don't, we don't know if she, she's the, the one. Yeah, she can, I think. So she's playing for 15 points to close his last rack, her last rack. So with stroke on that through three. Yeah, she now 
needs to come back for the five. Two cushions, yeah. Yeah, and she made it really good. Perfect. So, really great. One pull run out. Ramilul, 15 points for her. Nice. Yeah. And she finished with 58 points in 10 breaks. So yeah. now, turn for Pichus. You can break. So, let's see the end of this match 73, 79, 85. Oof, yeah, Daniel so tight. Yeah, any of them could qualify for the next round. Yeah, we had a similar match. I think it was the one of Damianos. Yeah, that's right. But it was with the four players, I think. Yeah. So, the break from Pichus. Now look at oh. the people. Ooh. Perfect. So now. Tough shot for 15 points, but yeah. he sees it. Now that's where you have to decide. Yeah. Risk or not? Because, yeah, you could, be and you could be qualified with 10 points, but you need a mistake from the other players. So what to do? Oh, he took body hand. So, yeah. He needs minimum six points to tie the score with a bit. And with body hand, it's not that easy from two to three. Yeah. Enough? A bit short. Yeah, a bit short. Oh. Mm, he looks a bit disappointed. So I don't know. If he's not able to make it straight, probably he has to choose the bank shot. Oof. Yeah, it was. Oh my god. Yeah. Looks like he cannot make it. Yeah. Even the jump is too risky. Looking at the bank shot in the bottom left corner pocket. Wow, oh my shot. god, look at that. What a shot he made. Nice shot. 
Wow. Chris is clapping wow. the hands. That was an amazing shot. Amazing. From Pigeus. And what a moment to make it. Oof. Yeah, exactly the right moment. Well, and he almost made the 10. <laughs> yeah. Okay, now he needs to finish this track. So, with that ball, he's tied in the score with David. Yeah. But of course, he wants more. Really, really good. What a rack. Yeah. Right run out. And... Fantastic shot. What a shot we see. So, 10 points for Peaches. Nice one. Chris is clapping. Yeah. He <laughs> finished that with. Was, that was the shot of the week. <laughs> oh my God. Yeah, it could be. <laughs> so, he finished with 83 points. And now, turn for David. Yeah, let's see. David, he needs at least five points. Yeah. Four to tie, five to win. To get qualified. Good break from the bid. And perfect shape on the one. Really nice break. And he has a chance to go for 15 points. Yeah. So, three more balls to tie up the score with Peaches. Let's see, because from two to three, yeah, it's really tough. He could have, yeah, he could have and problems. He needs to secure at least three more balls. Okay, he's taking Bolihan. hand. That's a smart choice. Yeah. Mm, to straight on this one. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. I think he, he wanted to be closer to the cushion. Oof, but let's see. Yeah, maybe he can draw it, but it's too long. Yeah, it's a long draw. You need perfect control if you want to have a good shot on the three. But I think he should make it. He's thinking about the follow shot, using the cushion. And he hit it pretty good. Yeah, not, he's it's angle. not an yeah, it's not an easy shot. But you know, when you play a follow shot with the ball so close to the pocket, sometimes the cue ball stayed there. <clears throat> I 
and he made it. So yeah. now he's tied with pigeons. Tied with pigeons. He's straight on the floor. Yeah. Perfect position. Yeah, and he is qualified with that ball. Wow. Really nice. Yeah, we what could feel the pressure there. <laughs> Yeah, that normally works good under pressure. Yeah, it was really, really tough, Rack. Sí, sí. <laughs> so, no pressure now. Two more balls to score 10 points. And he made it 10 points for the bid. Perfect. Uh, he yep. finished with 89 points. And now turn for Chris. Yeah, let's go. He's already qualified for the next round, but let's see his last rack. And how many points he gets? Yeah. 15 points to make 100. One ball on the side. And he has a shot on the one. So hopefully he will try to make a one pull run out to finish with a hundred points yeah we've seen only uh two players right making more than 100 mm, i with saw joshua no joshua made uh, 99. no joshua made 90 we, we we had already three players it was one of them was aloysius jap Ah, uh, yeah, Carloviado and, and yeah, Carloviado and Tyler Steyer. Yeah. Yeah, we remind you that Carloviado made one hundred and twenty-seven points. Yeah, amazing. Ah, uh, oh my god! Yes. So one point for him. Eighty-six after yeah, ten breaks. Enough. And that's all. So if you can come in front of the camera, please. No, no, no. Uh, David, yes. Chris, Elul. Oh, where's Elul? Elul, we lost your camera. Yeah. So first of all, congratulations to Chris and David. Thank Great you. performance. It was really interesting match for us and for the fans. Uh, Pijus, you made the last effort uh, till the end, and it was really great. You made a beautiful shot. It was the three, right? And yeah, I made myself there, so that's why you stayed. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but anyway, you solved, it. Yeah. you solved it. And what to say? You you made only one mistake in the whole match. Uh, yeah, I, had, I had a bad kiss, I think, on the eighth track, so I think it was a turning point. I broke good, but, you know, happens. Yeah. And Chris and David played, like, amazing, you know. I just wanted one dry break, but no. They kept me on a leash, and that's it. So, yeah, congrats to David and Chris. Really Thank you. Good. Yeah, and anyway, great performance, Pijus. It was a pleasure to watch you playing. You played great. Okay. And same Thank for you, Elul. You you were a bit unlucky with the breaks, but yeah, you almost didn't miss. Only dry breaks. That's all. Yeah, yeah. I missed uh, all the breaks. We cannot hear you really good. So now, probably, yeah. Hello, we couldn't hear you. Yeah. Yeah, so how was your feelings on this match? I mean, of course, it was more the break, but you played well. Yeah, I missed the break. It's not yet. Uh, you see, it's uh, on time. 
no no money both in both the pocket and but uh, they they are play the very well uh, the, the next round good luck all players yeah so thank you very much Elul. it was thank a pleasure you. and we hope to see you in the next tournament yeah. so yeah that's all guys from today it's over and tomorrow we have more action in the next round that's 32 yeah so thank you very much good luck to Bye. david and chris Bye. Uh, Bye. Good luck, david and chris. thanks yeah. congrats again Bye bye. Thank you so much. Thank you.